If there's no viable path, we'll just have to make one. Let's head on back to the H1 sign. I hope that Jesse's injury isn't anything serious. The best thing you can do to speed her recovery is to kick Shinra ass in her stead. I know. I know. And Cloud's got a cover for Wedge, too. You work. He knew we might be late, so he came up with a few ways to kill time. We ought to reach him long before he dies aboard. And we're back at the cargo platform. Get ready, Marco Reactor 5. We're coming. Auxiliary power supply confirmed. Reactivating cargo platform. Cargo platform activated. Awaiting input. <laughs> so long, underplate. I hate you too. Yourself. 
it's on you. All right, watch and learn. Get your ass out of here. Suck on this. Okay, Big should be waiting for us up ahead. He's probably worried sick about us. everywhere why didn't you say something sooner way too late to bail now it's like walking a tightrope when you're on it only two ways off better keep my balance yeah, we'd be good at it <laughs> I wonder Jesse and Wedge. Report. Topside's going nuts after some terrorists jumped off a train. Nice and quiet here, though. So quiet I had no trouble securing your route into the reactor. You magnificent son of a bitch! Bring it in! <laughs> so, where are Come the others? On, man. Jesse got hurt and couldn't make it. Bad? Not so bad she couldn't rope in this guy. Thanks for stepping up. It's a job. Worked out pretty good. You picking that train you did. While Shinra scours Sector 4, you can waltz right on into Sector 5. It's a bit of a squeeze, but it ought to get you where you need to go. A little dark and foreboding for my taste. Beggars can't be choosers. Oh, and you'll be needing your grappling guns, of course. All set? Ready to take on the world and then some. Make sure everyone gets clear, okay? Will do. <sighs> okay, y'all. Keep these grappling guns close. <sighs> Secure them to your belt or whatever so you don't lose them. When we're done, we'll be using these babies to get down safe. Got it. Hmm. <sighs> More to the left! The left! Wait. Hurry it up! Fix those <laughs> lights! Excuse me, sir. Your tie? Quickly now! Quickly! Hmm. Reeks of Marco. Looks like we made it.
Layout's the same as Reactor 1. Yeah. We're near Mako storage. Let's move. I'm not seeing a way down. Here, maybe? Well, now. That could work. I'm next. from Sunday. Mechanized units like these were designed to take out giant monsters. Probably a new prototype. If they do decide to deploy it, then our best bet would be to run like hell. Oof. Then let's hope he sleeps through the explosion. Everybody. You mean Shinra? <laughs> Got spooked and cleared out, is my guess. No match for me. You Yeah! <laughs> 
that right? Yeah. Soldier boy. Tifa. What? time we need. Got all the time in the world. This one comes with a remote detonator. Courtesy of Jesse. We withdraw to a safe distance. Then, kaboom! Safe distance? What? No such thing. <laughs> we get out the same way we got in. Let's double back. Huh? What the? Where are you going? Weirdly perfect timing. Wait a minute. Is someone watching us? has confirmed the reactor to be the target of the bomb threat issued by the terrorist group Avalanche. <laughs> Members of the group were observed entering the facility, and security is currently sweeping it for explosive devices. We now go live to the scene. I'm here in the Sector 5 Undercity. Having confirmed the terrorist target, you guys the Shinra Emergency Operations Center has issued an evacuation advisory. Residents are outraged that the tragedy of Mako Reactor 1 was only the no first attack in a campaign no of violence. President Shinra has issued a statement providing assurances that the terrorists will soon be brought to justice. And so, 